Hi, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and in today's video, we are going to talk about the Electrolux washing machine air code EC. But first, what does this air code mean? The error code EC on the Electrolux washing machine indicates a problem with the electric supply. When the electric supply is insufficient, the washing machine won't work at optimum capacity, posing a risk to the motor. The following are some of the common causes of this error code. A faulty start switch. The start switch is the button you press to start a wash cycle. If the button is faulty, the machine won't receive an electric current to the control board. A faulty control main board. The control main board controls almost all the electrical functions of the washing machine. If it's faulty, it gives irregular responses and might be the reason for the EC error. A faulty power plug or breaker. A faulty power plug can translate to the washing machine getting an irregular power current from the mains. An EC error will be displayed if the machine detects a power surge, thus alerting you of an underlying problem. Faulty wiring. This is another common issue that can cause a problem with the power supply to the machine. Wires can degrade over time due to prolonged exposure to heat or damage by rodents, leading to the error code. Now, let's look at the best solutions you can apply to fix the error code. Ensure the start switch is working. Locate the switch and observe how it's mounted. Unplug the machine from the power source, remove the screws that hold the switch in place, and disconnect the wiring going into the switch. Connect the new switch to the machine's wiring harness. Return all the bolts to secure the switch. Clip back the control panel to its place, ensuring that it's well fastened. Ensure the control main board is powered on. You can check whether there's current through the main board by using a multimeter. If there's a fault with the control board, it's advisable to change it to a new unit. Ensure the power plug is okay. You can test the power plug by either using a multimeter or a circuit tester. It might just be a simple fault like a failed fuse which can easily be fixed. Ensure the wiring is in pristine condition. A quick inspection of the wiring harness can give you an idea of the state of the wires. Make sure all the wires are well secured and insulated. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Till next time.